House Democrats were heading toward an uncertain vote Friday evening on the $1 trillion infrastructure package, but a final vote on the larger social spending and climate bill was delayed by continued infighting between centrists and progressives. Democrats are also planning to vote Friday on a procedural measure related to the social spending bill. But a final vote was put off for over a week to allow time for the completion of an economic analysis of its costs demanded by moderates. Scheduling the votes amounts to a significant gamble by Speaker Nancy Pelosi, D. San Francisco, because progressives have said for months that they would vote down the infrastructure bill unless it was paired with the social spending package. On Friday, progressives urged Pelosi to postpone the infrastructure vote, with some threatening to vote against the infrastructure bill if Pelosi insisted on bringing it up without the social spending bill. It remained possible that Pelosi would cancel the infrastructure vote if it appeared the measure would fail. Bills rarely go to the House floor, particularly under her speakership, without assurance they will be successful, adding a significant level of uncertainty to how the evening would proceed. But on Friday, Pelosi said she believed there are a large number of members of the Congressional Progressive Caucus who will vote for the bill. That is my understanding. Pelosi faced few good options. Members of the Congressional Black Caucus, who hold significant political sway, urged her to hold the two votes as a show of progress. Moderates would only agree to that if the vote on the infrastructure package was held first, according to Democratic sources. While most major pieces of legislation suffer fits and starts during the legislative sausage making, the frenetic negotiation over this package has been particularly fraught, a reflection of the slim three-vote margin House Democrats hold. It briefly appeared Friday that progressives would back off from their demand to hold the two votes together. But now they must decide whether they will vote down part of Biden's agenda on the floor and deliver Pelosi her first floor loss on a major vote. They huddled for more than two hours in the congressional meeting room to hash out a plan. If the infrastructure bill fails, it won't die. 